Hello and welcome back to Income Strategies, the place where you learn how to make money, multiply your money and also manage your money. Today I'll be answering a question that one of my subscribers have asked and this is the question. It says, nice video always. Please Ma, can you make video on how to use coin market cap to make profits in Binance or any exchange? So today I'll be talking about a free tool that anyone can use, you know, to check, you know, the different prices that, you know, different coins are being listed on, on different exchanges. So that's it. One of the things that we can use, like I told you earlier, going to Binance, that we have uh, Binance's own scanner, you know, arbitrage scanner. And I'm going to show you that in a bit, which is the compare market um, element where you can check on the different places where that particular pair is listed and how much is it is listed on. You know, I had already spoken about this a lot in triangular arbitrage because as you can see here, the prices are listed on different markets. We have BTC is BTC slash USDT. This is the price 23145. You can see it's changing. BTC slash AUD is 23147. So you can see that this is how you take advantage of, you know, the price differences to get your triangle arbitrage done. So let's go over to CoinMarketCap and uh, so that we can understand how this works. It's just very similar to the way the scanner in Binance actually works. It's just practically the same. In fact, I'm being told that, you know, Binance actually owns my um, coin market cap. So it's, it's really very interchangeable and, you know, they're related. So take a look at this. You go to coin market cap and once you get to the page, you'll see that a whole lot of um, coins are listed here. Now you can decide to take any one of them so let's look for one. Let's look for one. Let's look for, let me look for a coin that's not too expensive. Let's look at for TRN. Now you can search for any coin in this exchange, any coin. So it's going to, let me go to, to, uh, to Tron. And you can see here we have TRX. Um, this is the current price. The general price is 0 0.067, right? Of course, you know, it's not a stable coin, so it will keep on moving up and down. So if you want to check the price of TRX on different exchanges, all you just have to do is scroll down after you've selected the coin, you come to markets. So when you click on market, it brings out the different places where it is listed. So for instance, you can see here on the different exchanges here, let me enlarge this. You can see we have Binance here, we have KuCoin, we have Kraken, we have KuCoin, we have different ones and different pairs, right? You can see all the different pairs, TRX, Euro, TRX, USDT, USD, TRX, USDC, uh, w i n t r x all the peers that you can ever think about and you can see all the different exchanges so for instance if you wanted to find out between kucoin let's check kucoin here the price of this um t r x no let's let's put it this way you can see this is um kucoin here let me just enlarge this so you can see it we have kucoin and we have USD, USDD, <laughs> I've not even heard of that before, USDD TRX. What's the price? The price is 0 0.06766, all right? Look at the next price, is 0 0.06776. Can you see that there's a change, there's a difference, right? So that means that if you wanted to, you know, take advantage of this on the same KuCoin, you could actually do an arbitrage, you know, that would make use of those prices, okay? So it's just as basic as that. Let's look at it again on other exchanges. Even PancakeSwap, which is a decentralized, you know, exchange, also has the listing, as you can see here. It has TRX BUSD, right? It has several listings here. If I look at the price, what's the price? The price is 0, 0 0.06745. Now, can you see all the different prices here? So all you just have to do is to take your time, sit down and begin to check. You can even decide to even go deeper and check even more. Look at we have uh, Bitfinex here. We have Kraken here. You know, so it just shows you can just even click to even see even a better view. You can go deeper to dig deep even into their own personal exchange. You can say just click on one and it takes you to Kraken. But I don't want to actually do this. Right? Let's get back into you know Coin Market Cap. It's just that you can see that the the peers are they are 
highlighted here. So that, that means that there are links which you can click and takes you to the exchange directly. Okay, so that's it. Let me, let's choose another coin. Let's choose another coin and see the difference. Let's look at XRP, for instance. Let's go back and let's look, look at XRP. Okay, so uh, seeing this, okay, let's just go back to where it, the, all the coins were listed. We can, you see, we have Dogecoin, we have Polygon, all the coins that you can think. In fact, I'm being told that there are over 13,000 coins listed and there are always more listed every single day. Just take a look at one. Let's look at this. Um, let's look at Bitcoin Cash, right? And let's look at the different prices. Currently $133, right? You can see just changed. It was 132, now changed to 133. You want to check how much Bitcoin Cash is listed. You just go to markets. And you check on your favorite exchange, right? If you have two or three exchanges, you can do inter-exchange, you know, um, arbitrage. Or if within the same, <clears throat> excuse me, within the same platform, you can check for the variance, right? You can check, like, look at this now. Look at this now. We have Binance. We have Binance. We have Binance. I can see the different types. We have BCHUSDT. We have BCHBUSD. And we have another one here. BCH BTC. Now let's take a look at those three. Now you can actually do a triangular arbitrage with that. Okay. So let's take a look at this BCH USDT. How much is that? Let's take a good look at that. You will see that it's 133.12, right? So let's check on um, how much it is, how much BS, uh, BCH BUSD is, whether it's a different price. You can see that it's 133.23. Can you see the difference here? We have it as um, USDT, let me let me make sure that you can see that very well. So BCH USDT is costing one thirty three dollars point twelve on Binance, the same Binance. So let's look at it again. BCH BUSD is costing how much? One thirty three point two three. That means that we can see the difference. You can see the difference, right, in the price. Let's take a look at this third one, right? That is BCHUSD. BCHUSD is 132.96. Can you see what is going on here? BTC is 133.36. You can actually do, you know, an arbitrage like this. You can actually look for the cheapest price, sell to the higher price, and sell back. That's how you make money in triangular arbitrage using coin market cap right? Let's just do one more coin, right? I think right now you understand the way to go around this, right? Let's look for one cheap coin. Let's look for a cheap coin. Let's look for a coin that is not that expensive, probably under a dollar. Let's see. Let's go look for that. Okay. Let me look for another coin. Okay. Should I look at Doge? Doge coin is eight cents. Okay. Let's, um, let's go for that. Let's go for Dogecoin and let's see. Let's see how, how this is now. Now you can see this is 0 0.08. That's the general price, okay? So now for us to look at the markets, we're going to check on the markets and see where it's listed. All the places where Dogecoin is listed. You can see it's on KuCoin. Uh, what's the price here? That's 0 0.08056. Uh, you can also see it's on Kraken. What's the price? We have... 0 0.0805, right? So we can see the differences in price. What was it that I called that? Was it okay? That was, and the prices are not stagnant. So it changes what could have been 06, now it goes to 05. You know, so the whole idea is you just have to take a t your time to sit down and check through the coin of your choice, okay? And now look through the different exchanges that you have and you can now begin to compare the prices. Okay, that's the work that you have to do. It's already listed here. You just have to sit down and do your own research, right? And check on the different prices of the coin you want to use for either inter exchange or triangular exchange. Okay, triangular arbitrage. And I, I believe you've learned something. If you are still not clear about it, please let me know in the comments and I'll try to do justice on it again. Okay, God bless you and I'll see you in the next video.